These Gin Academy students are learning how to code, a computer skill most of them didn't have before they started attending the Hit in the CLE after school program. I learned many things about coding, how when it comes to codes, you need different type of attributes and how if you want to design something, you can use CSS, which is basically, a, a, it's like a style sheet. So anytime you want to basically add color to your letters and anything, you use a CSS and how Anytime you want to start out a web page, you always got to start with HTML. Did you understand that? For most of us, all we see is this, a web page. But in order for a web page to look like that, you have to know how to read and write these codes. It's just like you putting all that hard work in anything. You, you not quite 100% understand it, but you have an understanding of it. These students are catching on to the fundamental skills of coding. Grady Burroughs is the director of health talent at BioEnterprise, a nonprofit healthcare and bioscience business accelerator. He runs the Hit in the CLE Community Classroom, an after school program for high school students in Cleveland and surrounding suburbs. This is a collaboration between BioEnterprise, the Cleveland Foundation, and other community partners. The goal of the program is to grow a talent pipeline for IT industries like healthcare and biomedical located right here in Northeast Ohio. It's vitally important because the, the reality is that employers here in Northeast Ohio realize that if they don't have a workforce that is not only capable and skilled, but diverse enough that it reflects the fabric of Cleveland, they're not gonna be sustainable for long-term growth here in Northeast Ohio. So our CMSD children are really the best not only from a number standpoint, but from a representative standpoint of who is in Cleveland to be future pipeline participants in this job market. But in order for that to happen, Burroughs says students need to be exposed to computer coding and all it has to offer. So when we talk about computer science or data science, they really don't understand the applications in today's workforce and how relevant and important it is in so many different fields, whether they're interested in medicine, business, law, because quite honestly, there's not a lot of folks in their communities, in their neighborhoods, uh, within the environments that they work who hold those jobs today. These students meet at least two times a week during the school year to learn digital literacy and coding. Burroughs is also exposing them to entrepreneurs and venture capitalists, so these students can understand how computer skills transcend across many sectors. Our goal here at the Community Classroom is to really energize and catalyze the students, the high school students, to excite them to really have a passion uh, or, and grow their interest for computer science and coding. Many of these young men plan on making coding a part of their career. I want to become an engineer, so this coding class could actually improve my engineering skills just in case I want to go inside computering with engineering. And for those still deciding their career path, like Jalen, again Academy 10th grader, this skill will be useful. I can build web pages. I'm good with um, I'm good with HTML, CSS, and all that. It gives me it gives me like it gives me a special skill that could give me a one up in this world.